Yeah, I really enjoyed the course. I like the fact that it's a mix of like hands-on and written work. It's not all just essays, so it makes it a lot more interesting. And you kind of learn as you go. Like I've picked up so many skills since I've started the course, like camera work, all that kind of stuff. Like you learn a hell of a lot as you go. It's going to make a lot of difference back home when I go there. And because the studies that I'm doing right now, this the course that I've done, it's really very current and it is de developing like my skills and all that kind of things, which is really lacked back home. So it can enable me definitely to, to add something to my culture. A lot of people will believe that the only um, courses that are worth studying are STEM courses, which I believe is completely untrue because every different form of knowledge has its own challenges and stuff. So I find media and studying of media incredibly interesting and so it's not easy but it's something I'm adept to do whereas other people are adept at studying psychology or studying maths and stuff which I can't wrap my brain about but they wouldn't be able to understand what I'm doing and it's not like I'm doing nothing I'm doing a lot of readings and there's a lot of theories and stuff that goes into it. It's not a made-up subject as a lot of people believe it is. I really enjoyed all the practical work. I quite enjoy essays as well, I know not everyone does, but it's quite, I quite like all the practical stuff. Like I've learned a lot of filming techniques, all stuff, stuff to do with sound and radio, which I didn't necessarily think I'd learn on a journalism course, but I have. I think I probably am a better person from uh, taking part in this course because it's, it's provided me with more life skills. Like I've had to do everything on my own. I haven't had the, well I've had support from my family, but it's been, the work has been down to me. If I don't do the work, I won't get the results I want. So it has given me a lot more motivation to be more independent. So as well as my dissertation, I did some work experience with their share. And that involved me attending work experience every Wednesday where I'd just go into the office and volunteer and do some help, um, help for them, do some office work. Um, I used to write case studies for them. Um, I used to visit the, the CFMs that they're partnered with, that they, the charities that they donate their food to. And um, yeah, it was good extra experience on top of the degree. When, while I was at Newport and doing my work experience at the Riverfront, um, they said, oh, you should really look at doing um, film curating as a master's in London. So that was really interesting because I didn't know, it opened so many doors, like I didn't know things like that were actually possible. So the Riverfront helped me in so many ways in that sense. Just go for it. <laughs> Just, you know, sell yourself. Don't be nervous about it. Um, I didn't want to come to university, but my friend sort of said to me, you'll regret it if you don't. You'd, it opens up job opportunities, it opens up friendships, you know, you can go travelling, you can do whatever from coming here. If I'd stayed at home, I would just be stuck, not doing anything and probably working in a shop somewhere, so... <laughs> I really liked Cardiff, I really liked the um, environment has it. There's a lot of... It's a, it's a massive community of people together and the University of South Wales, for me, that was one of their ideals. It was a, a community of people coming together and studying, which I really enjoyed and it's... it's it's quite remarkable actually.